Hi, I'm Chad, engineering manager at Super Springs International, and today we're discussing why bigger isn't always better. Is a bigger, stronger Sumo or Super Spring always a better option? And the answer to that uh, is no. Um, we do provide and um, produce different levels of support for different vehicles and different applications, whether it be our Sumo Springs or Super Springs. The reason we do that is so that you can better tailor what product is going to work best with your particular situation. Not all people use their trucks the same, not everyone um, loads their trucks or RVs the same, and not everyone wants the same effect. So um, we try to provide options so that you can better uh, tailor it toward what you want and the performance that you want out of your vehicle. Our Sumo Spring line, we typically offer multiple different densities. So that's why you see the different colors, mostly blue, black, and yellow. And they range in uh, load capacity in that, in that order. So we have our blue is the lighter densities and the softer material. Black is the medium and yellow is the high. And just because we offer a yellow Sumo Spring for your application doesn't mean that's the one you automatically want to go to. In some vehicles, if you don't have a whole lot of weight in the vehicle and you're looking more for like better handling, uh, smoothing out the ride when you're, you know, on the freeway hitting expansion joists, things like that, you want to go with a lower density because that's going to have better um, vibration dampening characteristics. Um, whereas if you were to go with too strong of a spring, then you're going to be over compensating and it's going to actually produce a, a, a harsher ride. So with um, same goes with our super springs and a lot of applications we have different levels of super springs um, because it's dependent upon how the truck or vehicle is being built and used. Again, if you use too strong of a spring, you're going to induce a harsh ride. If you have a vehicle that's very heavily loaded, like with a big camper, or a work truck that's got a lot of tools and equipment, that's gonna require more force, more spring rate in order to have the same effect. So a stronger spring would be a better option in that situation. If you've got an empty pickup that's your daily driver and you pull a boat or throw your motorcycles in it on the weekend or things like that, where you want that a little extra support when, you're, when you are loading it up, but you don't wanna cause it to have a a harsher ride when it's empty, then you want to go with one of our lighter, uh, lighter options for the vehicle. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions for our engineers, reach out to us at marketing at superspringsint.com.